What's going on guys it's helios as you can call me hagen and in today's video we're going to be talking about zombie youtubers who quit now i think it was only fitting since i had actually taken a four five month break since my last upload so here we are counting down zombie youtubers who have quit now this is all my personal opinion on who i've watched so if you guys have anybody that you watch that you know that that has quit leave it down in the comment section below first up we have azura or phil Azura became a popular content creator on YouTube specializing in top 5 lists as well as rant videos relating to video games, most notably Call of Duty Zombies. His channel amassed over 200,000 subscribers, unfortunately it meant nothing because he eventually decided to delete all of his social medias, including his very successful YouTube channel. I believe the main reason for this is because he actually was able to become a police officer, something he mentioned he was going to school for many times in his videos. All jokes aside, I am saddened that he decided to delete all of his content, but I do understand some of the reasoning behind it. He he did ask was my favorite zombie YouTuber. Please make another Twitter. Follow me again, Phil. <laughs> Please. Next up, we have Wilbo, or Wilbo, the number one dead zombie YouTuber. Wilbo became a popular content creator on YouTube, specializing in funny moments and challenge videos, as well as guides to video games, mainly Call of Duty Zombies. His channel amassed over 50,000 subscribers, but it has decreased since he decided to quit posting Call of Duty. He did, however, attempt to make another channel for his skits and comedy videos, although he did decide to leave that channel as well. He claimed in an interview with fellow YouTuber MitchGames247 that he just got burnt out and didn't like how YouTube and Zombies was anymore. He decided to find a new calling and has shown interest in acting other forms of artistic practices such as music. He also followed me at one point, but now he doesn't and I'm big sad. Next we have Fantastical Gamer. Fantastical or Sam was a very well known member of many gaming communities including Call of Duty, Overwatch, GTA, and Fortnite. He amassed over 1 million subscribers on his YouTube channel. Unfortunately, he decided to switch his content to strictly internet memes and current events. He eventually decided to bring that content to a new channel called Vibe Out. He decided to keep all of his old content deleted from his main channel. A little while later, he decided to give the channel to someone or sell it. It's unclear at this time, but they really just post random videos and promote a lot of questionable giveaways. This is really saddening to me because I really love Sam's videos and they were always very informative, attention grabbing, and very well edited. He inspired me to pursue editing in a more serious manner, but just like the rest of the people in this video, it may never be found why they decided to quit. Next we have Iowa Gaming. Iowa Gaming Orion was one of the original zombie channels that posted many iconic glitch guides and funny moments. Eventually his posts became less and less and he decided that he's making very subpar videos and considered many videos not to be good and has even claimed that he burned a lot of bridges in his time as a zombies creator and took his emotions to social media too much and ended up losing a lot of his own relationships with successful content creators. He decided to stop making content and focus on other life goals such as cars. He, he also follows me on Twitter. Big W. Finally, we have Emulsify, who is one of the original high round zombie players that I actually watch. He's most well known for his high rounds on Shadows of Evil and Revelations. He would stream anywhere between 4 and 10 hours at a time, uploading his gameplays to his YouTube channel. He would take breaks from streaming every so often. He even took a long one before the release of Zombie Chronicles. Eventually, what would end up happening is after the release of Black Ops 4 and the never ending blue screens and glitches, Emulsify ended up not uploading again or even tweeting after 2017. Not much else is known about this fantastic player, but hopefully, he's doing well in whatever endeavor he is pursuing. Honorable mentions. First up on the honorable mentions, we're going to have Avery. I know I had to mention Avery mainly because of his success from streaming zombies and competing in ee for c and ZWC. He immediately went to a new game, Fortnite, which turned into his favor as he grew over 2 million subscribers from that game alone. Avery was most notably known for his Easter egg challenge streams as well as his personality based videos. He now uploads a multitude of content including Fortnite, Warzone, and has even come back to zombies a few times. Next we have Parker the Slayer. Parker originally was a Call of Duty zombie streamer doing customs and other fun challenges, but at some point he either changed or sold his channel and it was renamed to Battle Royale, but since the release of Black Ops 4, he has since reclaimed the channel and he has posted zombies content since. I thought I'd just mention him since he originally had changed his channel. Lonely Mailbox. Jack hasn't uploaded in forever, but he has been busy with school, making music, and other pulls of life, so it's not a surprise that he is a little bit overwhelmed. He's most notably known for his theory videos, zombie map raps, and fire lyrics in general. Jack could be included in this because he hasn't uploaded in like a year. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, if you could drop a like, that'd be greatly appreciated. Subscribe if you're new. Turn on those post notifications. That way you guys never miss an upload. And if you guys have any other YouTubers that you used to watch that don't post Call of Duty Zombies anymore, leave their name down in the comment section below. And again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. He's been trapped in his own mind, but it don't matter. He's got more time for the lover to arrive. If he's still alive, he could be revived, but he's dead inside. And he said it's fine. What a lovely lie that he left inside.